What's going on with all my billionaires out there? This is the guy, Hood's Billionaire. Welcome to Hood's Billionaire TV. Big favor, big abundance. On today's episode, we're going to be talking about rapper Quando Rondo's truck getting shot up in Los Angeles. Um, so let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Um, rapper Quando Rondo um, was out in Los Angeles um, with his friend Lil Pab. Um, they were in the SUV. Um, some guys pulled up in like a white sedan. Um, probably had to drop on him, probably was following him, uh, shot the truck up. Um, so it looks like Quando Rondo made it through unscathed, but his, uh, friend Lil Pab was killed. Um, so condolences to Lil Pab, condolences to, uh, Quando Rondo, condolences to Pab family, um, anybody that was involved in that. Um, so we're going to talk about a lot of things, um, on this one, you know what I mean? But I'm not going to try to hold y'all too long. Number one, um, we're going to talk about knowing how to move, right? Because we know out in L.A., L.A. kind of has a, a reputation for niggas getting robbed or getting killed out there. You know what I'm saying? So you, you got to move right. If you're there for some money, like be low-key about it. You know what I'm saying? And, um, you know, just move accordingly. You feel what I'm saying? You got to move accordingly, especially if you're on that type of time. You feel what I'm saying? So it's like, if he wasn't out there for no money, if he's just out there and was like some half ass just going out there to party or have fun type shit, that was already just a no-no. You feel what I'm saying? I just feel like that's not, this ain't the time for that right now. You know, especially till things cool down and with all the smoke that he got in the streets, not only, you know, because everybody keep bringing up the little dirt situation. There's no need to bring that situation up. That's speculation. We not finna bring down another black man or put his name into no shit behind no street beef shit. You feel what I'm saying? Whatever they got going on is no, is really just no need to speak on that. You know what I'm saying? Now I do know that Quando Rondo is a, a rolling sixties crip. You feel what I'm saying? So you know, I know he got some ties to be you out there. Um, you know, so I don't know quite what's going on, but it's just about moving right, man. If you coming out there. You know, tap in with your OG and your gang. You feel what I'm saying? That's the gang he moving with. You got to tap in with the OG over there and um, and just move the right way. And I seen the OG um, say some real shit, a Hoover, um, that they were saying that was saying he was supposed to, you know, he should have checked in. He should have tapped in. And um, I do believe in that. I believe in relationships. I don't believe in checking in with nobody. That's a friendly way to say extortion. You feel what I'm saying? I'm paying you some money for protection. I can just get security for that. You know, when you tap in with somebody, this is these this is just relationships. You know, with anything that I'm doing, if I'm in a, you know, let's say you in a real estate field, if you go to another market looking at real estate, wouldn't you tap in with some real estate and other fellow real estate investors and real estate professionals in that market, if you were tapping, if you were looking to invest in that market, doesn't that make sense? You see what I'm saying? So just, just, just communicating and having relationships with people. Yeah. If I'm in your backyard, I mean, this is some rap shit going on. We know, you know, how rap is and the energy that's behind rap and how rap can get dangerous. So, yes, every city you move to, you should have contacts. You should have relationships, you know, that you built on, uh, 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 you know, just genuine love and good vibes and organic, you know, love and honesty. And and you're supposed to tap into those relationships. So he was right on that part. If he's talking about some check-in shit, like some extortion shit, I don't believe in that. And then that just got to tell you, if you know you can, you going to get shot at like that or a nigga can get killed like that out in L.A., then you might have to chill out on L.A. for a little bit. That doesn't make you a, a hoe. That doesn't make you soft. That doesn't make, that makes you smart. That makes you intelligent. Read 48 Laws of Power. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's a, that's a good book to read. You uh, Read Sun Tzu or The War. Like, that's just smart. It's just smart. If you know it's wild like that out there, you don't quite know the grounds your relationships are on, then you might want to move away. You might not want to be out there like that. You feel what I'm saying? And if you got to go out there to get a bag, then you need top-level security. 
You know what I'm saying? You Quando Rondo, if you're going out to L.A. to get a, let's say, a 50K bag, I say about, you know, you might need to spend five of that on security, 10 on security. You feel what I'm saying? I'm riding bulletproof proof truck. I'm riding with security with me all the way to secure the bag, all the way back to the airport and getting the fuck up out of there. You feel what I'm saying? Because niggas is playing for keeps. Niggas shot this man shit up. Killed this friend. You feel what I'm saying? So, condolences, man. Like I said, that's all I really can offer is condolences. You know what I'm saying? Um, second is just the energy around it, man. I, I, I keep hearing, seeing y'all trying to throw OTF in that shit. And it's like, man, that'd be like some... It's just no need for that. It's just no need to bring in a, a another black man who living his life. And, and whatever they do is what they do. You feel what I'm saying? And that's for the streets. That's not for the internet. You feel what I'm saying? You know, and, uh, you know, people might want that, but you know what I'm saying? I just don't think Dirk would be dumb enough to, like, you feel what I'm saying? Move like that as hot as it is in rap right now. Like, rap is hot right now. You feel what I'm saying? Like, that just wouldn't be smart for him to move like that, so... I don't think that's the case, but you feel what I'm saying? But this just all go back to, like I said, moving smart, man. You know what I'm saying? You out in L.A., a known dangerous city, and you gangbang, and you ain't bulletproof trucked up with security, with bulletproof vests. Why wouldn't you move like that? That's just smart, man. That's just smart. That's just being 10 steps ahead. You feel what I'm saying? That's just a smart way to move. How do y'all let niggas trick y'all into thinking that, that like, playing life like it's fear factor is smart? You feel what I'm saying? I ain't fuck that shit. I'm a real nigga. I ain't wearing no vests. I ain't riding in no bulletproof, nigga. You know what I'm saying? I'm really like, man, nobody's really like that. They killed Pablo Escobar. When, when somebody wants you dead, they gonna do whatever they gotta do to make sure that you gone. You feel what I'm saying? So it's like, nobody's above the system nobody's above the program you feel what i'm saying it's like always move smart and give out pure and positive energy you feel what i'm saying i know that situation with vine you know it happened and it was self-defense and it was i mean and that's really just what that is and everybody living like that so they understand that Quando, i just in that situation and i know i'm going a little bit off topic but it's like uh it's a way he could have handled that. You know what I'm saying? After Vine died, he, he supposed to spoke on that in a different light. Like, hey, I didn't want nobody to lose their life. I wasn't intending on nobody to lose their life. This was straight self-defense, and I got nothing but condolences for that man's family and for that man's children and for that man's life and nothing but the utmost respect because, you know, we respect life around here, and I'm sorry that that situation had to happen. And then, boom, you don't speak on that shit no more. I don't got nothing else to say about that. I'm even, if I'm him, see, niggas not leaders. They follow under people. Even if I'm Quando Rondo, if NBA Youngboy tried to be on some, even if he starts speaking on it, I would tell him not to speak on it. Like, bro, don't speak on that because that don't need to be spoken on. You feel what I'm saying? That's some shit that I don't want to put no energy out behind and we shouldn't be speaking on that. You feel what I'm saying? And if a nigga be mad at me behind that, so be it. As he grow, he'll see what I was saying was the right thing to do. You feel what I'm saying? Because it ain't no need to speak on that. That's silly. That's going to keep shit going. You feel what I'm saying? But, uh, man, let this be a lesson, man. Y'all got to, you have to move smart. You have to move smart. And that's the second homeboy that this nigga done lost in two days. So that's the energy thing that I be telling y'all about. When you put out negative energy... When you on a negative type of time, it don't matter. You know what I'm saying? The energy will come back and it don't have to necessarily hit you directly. It can take the people around you. How many times y'all heard me say that in the video? Energy can take the people around you. It don't got to be you. You know what I'm saying? When negative energy, which I call the devil, you know what I'm saying? When it come to collect, it don't give a fuck about who or what. Nigga, if that's attached to you, it's going to take that. You feel what I'm saying? If that's attached to you, it's going to take that. You feel what I'm saying? So, it is what it is. But y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments, man. Was Quando moving right? You know what I'm saying? Was he moving right? Moving smart? 
You know, the, should, he, should he have been vested up or was he cool? Should he have tapped in? Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments, man. It's the guy who is being there. Big favor, big abundance. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Like, share, subscribe. This the guy who is being there. Big favor, big abundance. I'm gone.